Hello Amians, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you guys how to get amazingly glowy and smooth skin and clear skin before a special event. But make sure you have subscribed if you haven't already before I talk about my whole routine which is pretty detailed. Uh, but let's jump into it. So the first thing I like to do is remove um, all my facial hair. I like to do this 7 days and then 3 days before the actual event. Over here I'm using the straight shaver tool um, for my facial facial hair and I also like to thread my face um, and I actually use the IPO hair removal system uh, this is a long-term hair removal system and all you need to do is top ups um, it takes about 90 days to you know get the full effect going like be completely hair free um, but then after that you just need to do top ups and it's really comparable to laser hair removal um, I was thinking of doing like a proper um video on hair removal soon so hopefully i will get around to doing that after eid the other thing i like to do before any special events even though i do not show my hair is hair oil um so i like to put in hair oil at least eight hours before i need to shower and what i'm gonna move into now is my face routine so i am just um removing all my makeup using coconut oil and i am putting on these hydrogel patches um these are like eye under eye and cheek patches and um these have rose essence in them they smell amazing i think they also have flower water in them i will absolutely link everything in the description below um i got these from your style and the other thing i like to do is put on some nose patches um so these are basically blackhead and whitehead removal strips uh, it dries onto your nose and then you can just pretty much clean your nose um, once that's done um, So that's what I like to do and the other thing I like to do before my full-on facial, you know spa facial routine is scrub my lips um, I also shared a really yummy lip scrub on my Instagram if you have not already checked it out check out my instagram over here i'm using my favorite bubblegum lush one this is so delicious oh my god guys it smells and tastes absolutely amazing um and after i do uh, scrub my lips i'm gonna put on this lip mask so i've got my nose mask under eye mask cheek mask and now i like my lip mask i know i look really crazy um but when I have all these masks on, I like to do my nails. Um, I also like to do pedicure as well, but I'm not going to show you that today. I'm just showing you my nails and how I do my you know, nails at home. I'm just ch um, chopping off some nail, uh, shaping my nail, and then I'm just going to apply some nail polish. I also like to just buff my nails so they're super smooth. Um, and generally, my nails... You know are really healthy um over here i'm using my favorite viva cosmetics nail polish this is such a beautiful uh green color that i absolutely love um okay so <laughs> that was a mouthful um after i remove you know all my masks i am removing blackheads and whiteheads from my nose um and extraction is really important in spa facials because um you know when your pores are open you want to clear it of any dirt and impurities i am using this soap this is called the movis soap from lush i have wet my face over here and i'm just gonna um use the actual soap as a bar soap on my face this has like little wheat like bready particles which make my skin super smooth and soft any leftover i'm just cleansing my face with this the first step is to cleanse your entire face uh, make sure it's cleansed really well try to do this for at least two to three minutes um, and then i'm gonna wash my face um, the reason i cleansed it really well is because we're actually gonna be steaming our face i'm also putting in this dream tablet into my you know boiling water <laughs> to steam my face um, and this is really going to open up my pores and clear my skin and actually get it ready for the next step which is exfoliation um so i shared this really natural diy scrub on my instagram stories um this is basically oats 
almonds and honey if you have oily skin use nutmeg and i'm going to use this as a scrub and just exfoliate all the dead skin and because i um basically just steamed my face this is going to get really deep and you know just really clear my skin out um you can also do this on your lips if you don't have a lip scrub this is all natural okay this is where you do the mask uh you can do a natural mask i've showing you this papaya face mask which i featured on my instagram lately um or you can do a good old clay mask clay mask is perfect for detoxifying the skin over here i'm using a white australian clay um and this is like a really beautiful rosy face mask um so you just apply a thin layer of the face mask and you wait about 10-15 minutes um you can do this with with the natural face mask as well and when you remove that uh, this is when we you know layer on good stuff onto our skin i like to do a spray of rose water and glycerin this is perfect to add back the hydration onto the skin i also like to tone my face i've i like the sk2 and the hyaluric acid i like to mix them together in my palms and actually pat this on this is such a good way to apply toner because you actually put the moisture you know like back into your skin instead of removing it from your skin um once that dries i am adding vitamin c serum guys this is really important um and i'm gonna add the same vitamin c eye cream underneath my eyes i also pat this in don't rub it don't rub your face guys just pat everything in really gently um and now i am applying my moisturizer this is my homemade glow serum i've got a recipe on this which i will link below um oh my god and we're done <laughs> congratulations guys um if you made it this far and hope you guys have an amazing eid i love this